So, ladies and gentlemen, if I'm going to go ahead and do this problem, first thing we're going to do, I'm going to show you guys a little bit different notation. Mr. McLogan? Yes. You have Dave Ducoff in class? Yes. Can you ask her to bring a Lamont book bag, please? Backpack? I'm sorry? Lamont? Oh, okay. Thank you. Yep, you have to bring the backpack. All right. So let's go and take a look. So we'll show you guys just a little bit different notation. So the first thing is we need to take derivative of the first function, right? So you have first and a second function, right? And this product rule works only when we have our, the product of our two functions. So we're going to take the derivative of the first function times it by the second function. Add that to the first function times the derivative of our second function. Now again guys, I am only doing this to just show you guys how the product rule works. We know the easiest way would be to do a power rule, which I'll do in just a second. All right, but again, following through the following through this formation of f prime of x g of x plus f of x g prime of x, here's just a different way of looking at it. So what is the derivative of x? One times 5x minus 3x squared plus x times the derivative of 5x squared minus 3x squared is just going to be 5 minus 6x. Okay, now we can just go ahead and simplify to give us 5x minus 3x squared plus 5x minus 6x. Squared. Sorry. So therefore, the final answer is going to be a negative 9x squared plus 10x. Would you guys agree with me as far as on the product rule? Now, in this case, we have the luxury of being able to do the power rule rather easily, right? So let's just make sure we get our algebra correct, and let's do the power rule. So if I was going to do the power rule, I would distribute and I'd get 5x squared minus 3x cubed. And then by doing the power rule, I would get g prime of x equals 10x minus 9x squared, which is exactly the same thing. Okay? So, in this case, the power rule works exactly the same as the product rule. The problem with this case is the product rule is way more work than the I'm sorry, the product rule was way more work than the power rule. Would everybody agree? 